Hello ladies and gentlemen, welcome back to ServiceNow 911. In today's video, we are discussing about ServiceNow email notifications watermark. So let me show you first of all what is a watermark in email notification. Let's go to the email log as this is demo. I cannot show you the real email notification but I can show you how it looks like, right? So let me open this one. This is a log of an email and we can preview it from here. Click on preview email. You see here this is the complete notification and here. So this is the watermark. It is started with REF, then colon, then MSC, some wording, then underscore, then uh, again a text. So it may not have much more significance for you being a user but, but the system use it to the fullest. Basically this uh, watermark is telling the system that first of all this is an unique email and from where it connects. So while sending the notification and receiving the emails from other sources that is inbound email actions this particular watermark plays an important role and you can say a major role. Okay. So now let me show you some more about this. I have created one article you can see here this is my article. Okay, this is my website, Service Now Spectaculars. So this is a complete picture of watermark I already have shown you. And in this diagram it is very well explained the format of this watermark. It starts with REF colon, then a prefix MSG. Okay, this is same for all the instance but being an administrator you can change it according to you means according to your instance. Let's say, let's say if the notification is from depth you can set DEV here if it is from prod you can set prod here so from where you can do that you can do it easily in the number maintenance let me show you under number maintenance click on it you see here this is MSC okay this is email watermark so you can change the prefix here after that we have this automated generate identifiers this is of seven digit okay this will help the system to identify the target record and then we have an underscore and a 20 character string this is a random created string the second thing is you have the option to omit the watermark in case if you don't want to show the notification watermark on your email you just need to go to that notification and you can turn it off from there open any of the notification click on advanced view Go to what it will contain. Here you can see omit watermark. So if you check this one, you will not see the watermark on the email notification which will receive by the user. As simple as that. The last option is completely omit or hide watermark globally. So in order to do that, you just need to go to the properties and create this property. Glide.email.watermark.visible if it is not there and set it to false. Thereafter, you will not see a watermark on the notification. And remember, this is only for the email notifications that is the HTML messages. But in case of text messages which you are receiving on the cell phone, this is not applicable. So I hope you understand this uh, watermark concept thoroughly. If you have any doubts, let us know in the comment sections. And in order to get more detail, you can go to this link and read it by yourself. I'll post the link in the description of the video. See you next video. Till then, thank you so much. Bye-bye.